You know, there's just one thing I just don't get. See, I have my PS4 down there, right? Set up. You see, I have um Steve Miller Band, Greatest Hits 1974 to 1978. Focus. See? Got that. It, it, it's a disc. Hang on. It's a CD, ain't it? Steve Miller's pretty good, right? Let's plop that into the PlayStation 4. You see? You see what I mean? Unsupported disc. Watch well, out when I click on it. Remote. Not supported. Huh. Well, that's really strange. It's not supported. You're kidding me. You're kidding me, right? This is one thing I do not like about PS4. The disc is very clean, too. Hang on. Yeah, I had to check my disc. Sorry, everybody, for that weird cut. Hear that screeching noise it made. Because I accidentally like, threw it onto there. But you see, now, we'll turn this off. I'm going to fully shut down my PS4 because I'm going to unplug it. I swear, these things take forever to turn fully off. It's probably because you you leave them in. Fr you're supposed to leave them in freaking rest mode. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. I'll bear it back. I'll put you guys right here. See, let me put you guys in a better position. Okay, look, we got my PlayStation 3 right here. Well, this is not my main one. This is my slim model, but still, it's PS3. All right, we're going to take my PS3. Hang on a minute. Grab my PS4. Plug out these wires. Yes, PS3 slim, PS4 use the same exact wires. All right, take my PS4, move it aside. Take my PS3. Bring it into here and hook up the wires real quick. Okay. That's in. All right, let's get back to it. So, got my PS3 plugged in. Just hit this. In case you young viewers out there haven't seen what a PS3 looks like when it turns on. That's a PS3 turning on. We're going to take the same disc, Steve Miller, slip it into the slot here. Slip it in, right? Take my controller. See, audio CD. Okay, whatever. I don't want to do that. Let me pick a good song. That's a good one. We hear it while it's playing. Please do. Please still, Steve Miller. Do not copyright me. Okay, I better turn that off before the copyright police get me. But, y you see what I mean? Like, how does how does that thing right there not play CDs, but that thing down there does? And now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this out, first of all. Because, I mean, PS3 is not the only generation that did this crap. Take out the disc. Turn this off. 
Come on. Hey, it, it's turning off, all right? I swear, that doesn't take as long as the PS4 when turning it off. Now, I'm going to unset this thing, just temporarily. PS3. PS3. All right, I'm gonna take out Old Fateful. I'm probably gonna have to plug in an AV cable. So that's gonna take a few extra minutes, but PlayStation 2. My my original model PS2. This is from like 2001. 2002. I don't know when these fucking things are first came out, but this is one is a 2000 like one or two model. I can't tell. But I'm gonna set this thing up for you guys. Plug this in. Yeah, I'm gonna need an AV cable because it's practically the only way to hook these things up. AV cable. All right, now I'm gonna put this down where PS4 and the PS3 were. Let me just get the cable. Hang on. I get the cables. They're behind my TV. There we go. Got them. Right. Red, yellow, white. So this is probably going to look like it's really, really bad quality. Okay. And let me just switch my input. Turn on the switch. Um, EV, EV. I'm gonna go need to go get a controller. I'll bring it back, everybody. Yes, I am not gonna cut this video. Yeah, I'm not gonna chop this video like most people will. I know that saves time, but I don't really care how long I take. Okay. <clears throat> so back to what I was saying, PlayStation 3 is not the only generation that played CDs, man. I mean, watch this. PS2. In case you guys don't know what a PS2 startup is. Oh, great. There's a disc in there. Oh, that's a good one. Damn it. That's a good one. Simpsons Hit and Run. I wish I was playing that right now. Okay. Same disc. Steve freaking Miller Band. 74 to 78. Obvious. Put this into the PlayStation 2. Audio CD. Let's do the same track. You see, that's playing it just fine. In case you guys don't know it's Steve Miller. Okay, I better cut that because the copyright police are going to get me. Like, this doesn't make any sense. This thing down here, the PlayStation 2, plays audio CDs. The PlayStation 3 right here plays audio CDs. But this pile of junk does not. Like, like what the hell? Like... Okay, I understand that they were trying to cut down on all the costs and everything, but they really have to remove the CD player. This thing plays like DVDs and all that crap. I'll, I'll probably show that off in the next video. I mean, I don't know, but... Yeah, this thing plays DVDs. This thing plays DVDs. This thing plays Blu-ray. This thing plays Blu-ray. This thing down here plays CDs and DVDs. This one plays CDs, DVDs, and Blu-rays. PS3 games and PS1 games. My fat model over there plays PS1, PS2, PS3, Blu-ray, DVD, and CDs. My PS4 here plays PS4 games. And that's it. It doesn't play any PS3, PS2, PS1, or CDs. 
and it plays DVD and Blu-ray. My PlayStation 2 plays CDs, DVDs, PS2 games, and PS1 games. So this thing can only pretty much play PS4 games, Blu-rays, and DVDs. Like, what the hell? You can play, like, on that PS3 over there, you can play, like, six different things, seven different things. This you can play, like, I don't even know how many things, but quite a few things. This thing can play quite a few things. So if these could do it, why the hell couldn't that thing do it? You see, this is why sometimes I don't like my PS4. Because it can't do certain things that my 3 can. My 3 is older than that 4. That one is from 2009. That PS3 over there is from 06. That's from 2013. That is from 2002. Or 2001. Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, and there goes my controller. I'm gonna get out of here. But, like, what the hell, Sony? Doesn't make any sense.